All right, we here with Cornball. Cornball, what's going on with you, bro? What's up, man? I'm excited for the night. What's going on with you, man? Um, I was um actually there um when y'all did the taping for that Madeo interview y'all did. Yeah. And I was re-watching it the other day, man. You was kicking a, 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 a lot of dope shit, man, talking about, you know, the the politics of the media and the runaway and all kind of shit, man. Yeah. But um after that, man, I really wanted to go... Um, Check out your music. Your, your music is hot. Let me know um, what's the new project that you're going to run with now, and what can they expect to hear from you next? As far as like, you know, what are you pumping now? As far as videos and music. Okay, right now I mean I'm starting to roll out for the uh, album that's coming soon. It's called uh, First and Foremost. And I feel like for me that's just going to be a statement piece for me, letting people know that um, you know. I, I am one of them ones when it comes to, you know, talent in this city. And um, I've built my name through, you know, hard work in this journey of uh, just being a creative and, and making the most out of nothing. And um, I think um, it's going to be, you know, just me basically getting back to the basics and, you know, the foundation of what this is, and that's rap. Definitely, you know? definitely. Yeah. Which is important now, man, everything going on with, like, all the... Um you know, the beefing and all that. Yeah. And I, I ain't even gonna say beefing because it ain't beef, it's more hip hop battling. Right. What you, what you feel about the, the battle and apology and all that, if you don't mind me asking? Um, I feel like I don't think bro did enough to even apologize to me. You know what I'm saying? Even when he was saying about it, you know, disrupting his spirit and, you know, having a change of heart. I don't feel like that needed an, an, an apology though. You could just state that and that that just be that and let him take it however he take it. You know what I'm saying? I just feel like it kind of, um, you know, at the biggest moment in the world, you know, Dreamville was at the time, at that moment, it was big as hell, you know what I'm saying? And he used that moment to not only, uh, you know, convey how he felt, but I feel like because he is the only one from this city at the highest level, the world appears to, you know, think that everybody from that place is like that. And that's where my little, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, yeah, I mean, um, I, I, ain't, I ain't really got too many issues with it. And I completely respect it and understand yeah. it. The only thing that I seen that I really didn't like, I seen Joe Buttons was going off. Oh yeah, I won't feel it that either. I wasn't, I wasn't, I wasn't <laughs> with that. Mm -hmm. But, um, so the, the new project you're talking, um, what label is that gonna come out on? What 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 is the label that you're signed to? Is it, is it your label? Yes, or? for sure. Yeah, um, it's gonna be an, an extension from uh, Kids That Still Dream. So, um, yeah, it's, it's not gonna be my first project released through there. You know, I had a stint, you know, with Dead Play, but you know, that's over. And it says musically. Um, so yeah, we're gonna, we're gonna try to do it as a major label, as, as big as we can with our label. And your brand is Kids That Still Dream? Yes. What's, what's that mean? What, what's, what's the name from? Yeah, it's is still. It like a play off the Dreamville like thing? Or? Nah, for me it was just more so of, uh, you know, just you know holding on to your inner child as much as you can, or as long as you can, because that's the true essence of, um, you know, the, the idea stem from, you know, your creativity stem from. You know, you know, once you get a certain age, you kind of feel like you know, gotta grow up, you know what I'm saying, just in a lack of better words, or you, you know, you forget that, you know, you once had things that you wanted to do once you start having kids, you know, just holding on to that type of stuff. And I feel like um, I just want to display that, you know, at, at the highest level as I can. So, man, we here, man. As long as you wake up every day, you got a chance to chase that dream. Man. Exactly. So, um, as far as the, the you talking about doing it like a major label, yeah, like a major, um, what do you mean by that? I mean, you know, putting your budget together, you know, you know uh, making the right plays, you know, hitting the right scenes, um, marketing rollout, you know what I'm saying, uh, you know, back it with the merch, you know, just treating it like, you know, you do have label backing even though you're coming out your own pocket, you know what I'm saying? And, and the rollout is really important nowadays, yes. especially with social media and, every, you know, everything we yeah. got going on. Absolutely. What's uh, What you got planned for the rollout? Um, you know, we just this show is part of it. Um, I've been uh, posting some of the content. I got some merch um, in the chamber ready to drop. Um, I got a couple videos we um, on, on um, scheduled to be shot. Um, we just gonna do a lot of content surrounding it. Um, we're gonna do some uh, try to work on this short film also. So I really don't have a date for the album, but it's it's, it's ready to go. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. I don't, I don't know if you know, I, I actually shoot music videos. I love to shoot one for you, you know, when you come time to do your rollout, pick, pick one of your singles. Okay. I love to link up with you, come up with a concept and do a video. 
And you know, we both blasted out and promoted, you know what I'm saying? Okay. That'd be real dope, you know what I'm saying? Okay, let's do it. Too easy. So, so um, you performing tonight, or you just here representing and networking? Nah, I'm gonna do both, but I'm, I'm gonna do both. Uh, what yeah. you performing? See, we gonna have to got be here to know. Nah. Okay, okay. But I'm gonna start it off. I'm gonna start it off with a record that you know kind of gave me a name. I'm gonna start off there, and then we are gonna get to some new stuff that ain't out yet. All right. Well, I'm excited to see it, man, and I'm gonna try to record some of that too, man, so that people okay. can see that, man. Thank we you. We appreciate you, man. Appreciate your time, man. We're gonna let you enjoy the, uh, the festivities of the festivals. Thank you for your time, man. Stopping by with us. Right, thank you, man. Appreciate. Thank you. you.